The Philippines has stepped forward in discussions to acquire one of the most coveted warships in the Pacific. HMAS Anzac, FFH-150, freshly retired from the Royal Australian Navy. Reportedly, President Ferdinand Marcos Jr. met with Australian Prime Minister Anthony Albanese in Canberra, where the two nations inked a Memorandum of Understanding MO, on Enhanced Maritime Cooperation. During the meeting, talks regarding the potential transfer of the warship to the Philippines took center stage. President Marcos Jr.'s visit to the Australian Parliament marked the first by a Philippine president in history. Alongside his diplomatic mission, he sought to strengthen defense alliances by advocating for the acquisition of a warship deemed vital for Philippine maritime security. HMAS Anzac, FFH-150, a revered Anzac-class warship, has become the Philippines' prime target due to its exceptional capabilities and advanced technology. With state-of-the-art sensor systems, including the CEAFAR phased array radar and towed array sonar, as well as the MK.41 vertical launch system for evolved Sea Sparrow missiles, the vessel stands as an irreplaceable asset in modern naval warfare. The warship not only offers superior combat capabilities but also extensive operational flexibility. From maritime patrols to anti-piracy operations, HMAS Anzac has proven effective in various scenarios. For the Philippines, facing diverse security challenges in its maritime domain, the presence of HMAS Anzac could provide a critical edge in defense operations and surveillance. In comparison to other options under consideration by the Philippine Navy, such as the Pohang-class corvettes from South Korea, HMAS Anzac offers several clear advantages. Particularly, its diesel engines and CODOG propulsion layout align with the preferences of the Philippine Navy, providing reliable performance and high operational efficiency. However, as the Philippines gears up to secure this deal, it must be reminded that such endeavors are never easy. The decisions made by the Philippines will have significant implications for regional security dynamics, especially in response to the increasingly aggressive presence of other powers in the region. The strategic alliance between Australia and the Philippines plays a crucial role in this process. With Australia being one of the Philippines' strategic partners and the only country with a visiting forces agreement, both nations share a common interest in maintaining regional stability and maritime security. In efforts to fortify its defense capabilities and strengthen its strategic alliances, the Philippines must seize this opportunity wisely. Acquiring HMAS Anzac is not just about obtaining a warship but also about building robust cooperation and sending a strong message about the Philippines' commitment to peace and stability in the Indo-Pacific region. At 30 years younger than the Philippine Navy's BRP Gregorio del Pilar, the HMAS Anzac offers a considerable upgrade in terms of technology and firepower. Its superior capabilities surpass even those of the BRP Jose Rizal, the most modern vessel in the Philippine Navy's fleet. With its advanced sensor systems and weapon platforms, the HMAS Anzac could provide the Philippine Navy with a critical edge in maritime surveillance and defense operations. Moreover, the Anzac-class frigates are known for their versatility and adaptability to various mission profiles. Whether conducting maritime patrols, anti-piracy operations, or participating in multinational exercises, these vessels have proven their effectiveness in a wide range of scenarios. For the Philippines, which faces diverse security challenges in its maritime domain, the flexibility offered by the HMAS ANZAC could significantly enhance its operational capabilities. 
In comparison to other options currently under consideration by the Philippine Navy, such as the Pohang-class corvettes from South Korea, the HMAS Anzac offers several distinct advantages. Notably, its diesel engines and combined diesel or gas CODOG, propulsion layout align with the preferences of the Philippine Navy, providing reliable performance and operational efficiency. Furthermore, the strategic partnership between Australia and the Philippines underscores the potential synergies that could be unlocked through the transfer of the HMAS ANZAC. As allies committed to upholding regional stability and maritime security, both nations share a common interest in deterring aggression and promoting cooperation among like-minded countries.